Major southwest intersection closed at this hour due to a deadly early morning accident. Yeah, 23 ABC's Lauren Titus has been live all morning long and now brings us with the very latest and what witnesses are now telling us. Lauren? Good morning, Mike and Larissa. It's been three hours since that crash, and the wreckage has remained relatively untouched in that time. But just recently on scene now, we do have the coroner. Take a look behind us. This is the intersection of Ming and New Stein. As you can see, we've got about a dozen investigators here on scene, still going through exactly everything that might have happened. We want to show you video of what the scene looked like earlier today. Investigators are telling us that the crash happened around three this morning, and uh, we know that one woman is dead and one man has been taken into custody. 23 ABC. What was able to speak with an eyewitness who was right behind the woman at the time of the crash. Take a listen to what he had to say. Oh, she had the right of way. I was, I was probably a quarter mile behind her, and she had a green turn light. And then I saw her get hit and spun around and car go flipping down the road, and that was the end. We now want to show you what the suspect looked like. This is what police are telling us happened. The man did get out of his car and run after the accident. What you're looking at right now is video of him being arrested as he was trying to take shelter and hide in a nearby neighborhood. That, of course, didn't work, and he has now been taken into custody. No word on if he actually has been charged yet, and no word on exactly what caused this crash. What we do know at this time, though, is that one woman is dead and that this scene is going to be shut down till at least 10 this morning. Stay Tune for the latest details. Reporting for 23ABC, I'm Lauren Titus.